it's a Sunday morning blood champion edition returning to my roots the only game I play well and not very well at the same time is uh, World of Warcraft this is my troll we'll talk a little bit about math today and play games based on math and I think that would in include this game for a little bit Hearthstone and then maybe Borderlands 2 I've actually been playing that more um, especially with everything on high including draw distance it just expands the world so to speak but one of the things about Shadowlands which I am not even close to ingesting that content yet I have it um, I'm still kind of working on BFA battle for Azeroth um, the big mechanic in that expansion was uh, this Azerite Heart of Azeroth Heart of Azeroth um, it's a neck a neck piece um, but certain bits of gear have things that are unlocked based on the level of the Azerite amulet so this thing I'm going to show off today is, is pretty interesting. I'm going to miss it when I can't use it anymore, but uh, it's a haste mechanic for Destruction Warlock um, based on this flashpoint skill, but I'm going to take it out for a ride into the to the ether. Look at, <laughs> Look at this. War hurts. Yeah, it's pretty early in the morning. I can play like Overwatch. I'm still not good enough to like confident enough. I'm pretty good as a tank, but I just do quick matches. Like I don't really I mean I have friends online, it's ironic, but they don't play video games. Uh I am listening. Yes, me too. Let's yeah, let's go over to Watch yourself Nazbeer. Look at the draw distance on this crazy shit. I've been so used to playing this game with like low draw distance so it doesn't really seem as big as it is. <laughs> this is rough. Even check the thermals. Like it's still the 5700 XT. Um yeah, where we at 4200 CPU package 56 uh, yeah, it's it's been running nicely lately. I don't know what I did. Maybe stop fucking around with the real world. That's why it's working so well. I kind of stopped playing Fortnite. It just... I don't know. There's some weird... I got booted by anti-cheat. And I don't cheat, so... Scratching my head literally in real time why why bother I was part of that crew too like I paid the 1199 with tax or whatever um, it's just not my thing I know that there's like a Batman tie-in and uh, I'm not I like DC but not as not as invested so it's got me into like playing FPS's which I primarily have played like card strategy games and RPGs like my favorite strategy SRPG is this guy so that probably says a lot about me what's going on down here no oh, that's not gonna happen got a new mount lucky young it's uh it's a bow Looks really good on this card, too. Let's see here. I'm lost my sense of direction. Kind of like, like the stock market has lost its sense of direction. It's seriously kind of scary. Um, my dad... Uh, I, I do some invoiced work for my dad and a company he works for. Uh, and uh, he just 
sent me this really small bit of text to update that I actually added to my personal site. Uh, and it kind of basically is this disclaimer that says, hey, this advice is not solicited. I'm gonna put a hunter, uh, Havoc, and open up with Immolate. And hopefully this will proc. Yeah, proc. proc. What's the haste? It was up to 28%. Which is a lot. You can also use, and I'm I'm dumb because I never use this all the time. But berserking, with is a troll skill. That's oops increases your haste temporarily. But the point of flashpoint is that. Up with uh, immolate. Oh, hold on. Go away. Man, that's a lot of fire. You want to open up with immolate because if you look at the text of flashpoints, where is it? Your spells? No. Oh, it's the it's the hedge. Sorry. Um, when you deal damage to a target above 80% health, you gain that proc. Um, as a warlock, there's a lot of spell management, mana management. It's basically based on shards and casting time, but, but what do I know? I'm over by the worst warlock ever. I don't even know if I'm going to win or not. Definitely. Man, this is bad. Let's just get that out here. Take a rest. Just like press the buttons, but um, yeah, I just uh, infiltrated this blood troll village. <laughs> the blood trolls are pretty nasty. They like cannibals. Um, they eat t cannibals in in reference to the fact I think that they eat turtolins, which are the turtle race. But uh, it looks like they eat their own too. So and. <laughs> Q burial mound, and this is where they bury the remains. It's pretty tragic if you ask me. Uh, but that's why I play this game. Not for the cannibals, but for the lore. The story is amazing, as, as always. But uh, the turtle race, there's, they, they're actually the race that plays Hearthstone the most, I guess. Like, I've seen them there, there's some submerged boat in some harbor where if you go underneath it, it's two Tertullians playing uh, Hearthstone. Interesting trivia. Not like I'm looking for a job. <laughs> Warcraft is my life. Pretty much right now. Um, yes. My reputation precedes me. I've heard that one before. Which is my power? Who's this? Yellow. It doesn't matter. Slow powers. <sighs> but yeah, in terms of Azerite, I was reading that um, this this can be powered up to. 15 
or level 15 you see the it's got like its own experience bar but um it's unclear to me i think the skills like the critical strike haste mastery and stamina that stays in shadowlands it's just that any of these unlocked that and corrupted too which i never got into but uh, that's some end game guild content but yeah this has the flashpoint it's got passive impassive visage when you take damage you heal for 231 and then it's got a boost like you know like a booster shot what you want power denied spirits be with your man but the explanation I read is that in Shadowlands there's like an Azerite shortage or something, so they just don't work. There's probably good gear in there. I'm just kind of like, I would like to max out the amulet before I start that uh, that quest for that entire piece of content. What's what's the deal with? Oh, I saw George. Costanza like play mat for magic. My sisters, it was pretty disturbing. Gonna avenge me. I bought some cards. Blood, blood, blood. Not really. I'm, I'm into the stone mechanic, but it's really hard to collect that. My sisters, gonna avenge me. Uh, uh, yeah, it's been slow. Slow going. So apparently, the vaccine site is gonna be. Um, did I kill this guy already? Whatever. Let's just kill him. Full state. United Center, which is near me. That's good. State vaccination though, like I need a target. State is behind. It's like May 31st or something. Oh. 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 Yeah. There's me the back of me head. That does look really sick. It's transmorgified Uthalesh, the Deadwind Harvester. It's a warlock, uh, warlock quest weapon. Let's go to Dalaran, actually. Screw you guys. I'm going home. I haven't been doing any raids either. Like, I haven't done any dungeons. It's weird. There's a lot of solo content. Like, I just play this game because it's mentally <laughs> where my headspace is at. Fucking spells and demons and crazy, crazy wardrobe malfunctions. Wow, that's, <laughs> that's crazy. That guy's name well is met. crazy. Andrew Be Matthews. Careful. This is like my childhood friend. You know, no lie. I've been having like a lot of weird moments like that. Like seeing the creepy laugh in the background. Yeah. Who's this guy? Wendell Sparkleshine. Greetings. See this is my row of stuff that I can't sell. Bad troll, love poem, overused voodoo doll, masterwork statue of the first trolls, and which doctors juju bees? That's a currency, like obviously. Be seeing you. <sighs> Priceless. Priceless, like the bubble. <laughs> Speaking of a bubble, isn't Dalaran just one big bubble? That holy shit! There's a Magus. I never realized this. Magus <laughs> Commerce Exchange. Can Can I check in on my Blizzard stock? It's been doing pretty good. Wow, look at this. It's like it's someone with a like. I wonder if there's an options trader. Uh, 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 
legendary leathers. That seems like a, a niche. Yeah, you can tell there's a lot going on. But let's get rid of some stuff. Can't do that. Yeah, let's do that. I don't oh, have a target. I need a target. I've never I've actually never spent very much time here. There is like a really the violet hold. I think after this we'll play some personal just t taking you around the lore. The lore tour. The violet systems lore tour. <laughs> To your right, you will see the Violet Old, where, what's that dude's name? Archmage Fargoth, free from that blasted tower. That's the whole, there's a card, I don't, I don't know what deck, I think it's a mage deck that I have that in. The Violet, I'd see, I haven't even discovered it, but, but yeah, I, I guess we'll play some Hearthstone. We'll leave you be at the violet hold. Hey, there's some dead, <laughs> dead motherfuckers up here. Ah, <sighs> yeah, I have a bunch of characters that I need to level up: Showboat, G Fong, Snowpiercer, Power Burial, Toebreaker, the Toebreaker. But yeah some leisurely the full core set has been revealed I think what they're doing is instead of doing the where you could pay like what was it like 80 for like it's a real circus in here tonight 80 come in and grab a gajillion seat. cards um, like the last set they did like a mid mid-season refresh or like I think that's what they're gonna do but you can buy the pre-purchase. I haven't done it yet. I'm waiting till March. Oh yeah, you can get the full. Damn. That's a lot of money. You could also just save your gold, but um, I'm on the fence right now. Let's just play some games. I've been playing chain dragon chain dragon priest it's pretty ridiculous growing my hair out Taranda versus Taranda whoa, whoa. the goddess is my shield got Vol'jin in here uh, choose a minion. Normally we'd wanna. Yeah, that's pretty good. I think thought steal on the coin is the the baddest move you can make. I think I'm first. <laughs> Cause you can just tell your opponent's whole meta right off the bat. I like Thought Steel a lot. Vol'jin seems to work like if you have a high cost card in your hand that you want to summon for cheap, that's Vol'jin. And of course it's based Galacron. Galacron. You see my ID shirt in the back? Blessings to you. Not much going on there. Borderlands 2. It. I like the math in that game too. Like, that's why I think I like Godfall. Like, loot and slash, math and slash. Uh, I wonder. It's tax season, so I gotta get my mind <laughs> crispy. Activate. 
activate the obelisk. Activate the obvious. Job done. Ooh. Didn't I throw this out? Yeah, I did. Ooh, that's that's pretty good for card two to defender. Uh, I'm not holding a dragon. Um. <laughs> With <sighs> it's been warmer. This is for certain. Your wish is my suggestion. Hmm. Someday I'll be just hey, like you. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, I see that. That's rough. Grave rune with um he just filled the board with uh with those little people. Hmm. I don't know if that's the appropriate terminology. I would like to be respectful. I just saw um Ray, the Jamie Foxx movie about Ray Charles. Uh, and Warwick Davis is in that movie. <laughs> and and he, he definitely imbibes in a sticky substance more often than not. Count your blessings, mate! Take them out! I think I'm gonna try to do this. Well, that wouldn't make much sense. Well, yeah, actually it would. I don't really have many spells right now, so it doesn't make sense to replicate Sorcerer's Apprentice yet. I wonder. But yeah, you could do that. You could do a couple of things. That's troubling. Sort of. Hmm. I like having this wall here. It's it's great to lean up against when you're at, <laughs> when you're on your last leg. Okay. No real spells. Um. I will act as your skin. Huh. Pretty rough. Yeah, slow ass, slow ass stream. I guess that's what I get for trying the to broadcast the night in the morning. Ooh, Fate Weaver. Yikes. Yeah, playing Overwatch too early in the morning, it would be a, a bad look. I'm trying to be a little more um, respectful of. I mean, I always am respectful, but I wonder. Just trying to gel well with this uh, current living situation. 
I live by myself, but uh, population density in Chicago is very real. So, uh, no, don't do it. Don't do it. I guess I could just grave ruin the shit out of this. <laughs> That's a cool, a cool thing to get. Well, look at that bull. Yeah, actually, grave rune that is lucky Yoon. It looks like it. The the mount from World of Warcraft. What is a loon's will? It's me and the Chicago Bulls. It's me getting my vaccination at <laughs> the <laughs> Oh, that's ugly. That's ugly. Can't stand to have this on the board, so... I think this is going to be one of these games where it's convincing Infiltrator 50 million times. Because of Psycho Pump. I could see it. <laughs> the prescience is deafening. We'll see. I like this, like, if I had some higher cost spells, this would be fun. What is a loon's will? Still, it's just like you can continue to replicate these. Yep, see? Like that wasn't hard to to manage. Our home, our tombs. <sighs> oh no. It's gonna be one of these. Okay. Um Math. We need seven damage to take this out. This is your it is <laughs> Interesting. Um. By moon and spear. I don't know. I don't know that that was really worth it, but we'll see. This is punishing. Oh, you son of a bitch. It's one of my most unfavorite mechanics is uh, when someone swaps. Your feeble magic takes control of an enemy minion. Like you work all this time to build up uh, your character. And they steal it from you. Such is life. It is what it is. Wow, it's, it's super boring today. I'm sorry. I've just been trying to do these earlier and get them done. Because the, the biggest key to show people that you're still alive is you do something regularly. Hmm. And... No one watches my streams, but people do watch the YouTube. So they catch it catch it on the replay. 
I try to work on some music for Bandcamp revenue share, which is Friday. Let's, let's run on the, oh. <laughs> wow. Way to go. I think the best way to do this is Money needs fire. It's a brand new Yeah, you <laughs> You make it a big mistake, man. Yeah, I actually am making a big mistake. Um what should I swap? You make it a big mistake, man. Your feeble magic from you. Oh, nice one. Complex game. Jesus. Yeah, I guess it's it's gotten a little long in the tooth. Spider-Man, No Way Home. Isn't that that's the name of it? The, the last Tom Holland Spider-Man until the multiverse. Here's my s solution for the multiverse: come up with new ideas or new franchises. And that, yeah. That's cool. Well played. War. be my next multiverse the Seinfeld multiverse like they reboot Seinfeld infinitely with different versions of George Costanza that battle themselves isn't that like that Jet, movie, Jet Li movie the one where he clones himself I and wonder. fights a multiverse version of himself if I had to fight myself in the multiverse I'd be like look it's not worth it let's just pick your own multiverse and stay there <laughs> Pick your lane. Pick your lane and stay in. Hey. Played 30 cards. Lost a star. I guess we could play a round of Druid, then play some border lanes. Border lanes. I don't know, like, people, is that the cool game? I love how people are like, did so, like, two years ago. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I don't have $80 every every week to buy a new game. I used to work with somebody like that that, like, literally spent so much money on video games. Like, rough, rough figures. But, uh, and also, you know, I had to manage somebody who played a lot of video games on the clock. It, like, that's a rough one. That's why sometimes I think I should work for a video game company. Um, because I know how to make people productive while they play video games. It's called Salesforce Reporting. You know, if you use a CRM. What's that? Uh, you know, don't ask me that during a, a Twitch stream. Lunara, quirky turtle. <laughs> Speaking of turtles. No. The forest fights back. Oh. Um, 
Yeah. It's an interesting, interesting opening here. I also try not to wake up. My name. I wake up so early. It's not even funny. Like four thirty. That's what makes me a good employee too, right? Behold the jewels of the sun. The jewels of the sun. Tortolin shell soup. How's that? That would be a great cooking recipe. And it would like a cooking recipe <laughs> that Home like damaged damage your reputation with the turtle race. Could happen. I am actually um Let me work my Questing in Soul Bazaar to unlock the Volpera because I'm going to do a shaman, Volpera shaman at some point in the distant future <laughs> once I finally get back to level 60. I saw that they re released Classic Burning Crusade, that's what I quit at actually. I had a Shadow Priest at 60 and a Warlock at 60. It just was... The guild stuff was just like overwhelming. Um, let's see here. Magical! <laughs> Magical. Um... Voila! I'll take the card. Ooh. I'll probably lose it next turn. Unless he attacks it. They attack it. I don't know how to assume the gender of this turtle. But I, I assumed right in terms of what you gotta do. Alright. Let's go ahead. Wish is my that was a problem. Vengeance. I have to, speaking of math, like I think the thing that woke up the math FPS thing in me, aside from Borderlands, is uh, Cyberpunk 2077. Like, I'm stuck in that. In this I mall, grow impatient. In a mall. Sir, and it's like a campaign master. in and of itself. Wow, that's not good. They don't, they have rush. <sighs> That's going to be a lot of damage. Um, going to have to use that. That's a better outcome. This can be my we'll EP. Fine. It wasn't that big. No. It's hot. <laughs> I've been playing so much Overwatch lately. Like, I'll wake up at 4:30 in the morning, and I'll be like, "It's high noon." All right, let's see here. <sighs> I think. The health isn't something I'm worried about. Now, how about? Let's do this. Get the corrupt. Protect the roost. Go! What 
else has been going on. That's a cool card back, the 30 year card back. Oh. <laughs> I got a little bar though. Just one. It's like a two pound. They only have one. Went to target. Rush and Wind Fury. Yeah, let's do. Shit, that's harsh. They'll be good for next turn. Yeah, I do a lot of barbell workouts. My neighbors just put their uh, they have a weight bench out on the table there or the porch. That's a tough call. Five, eight, twelve damage to face. Let's see. Hmm. I think I'm gonna wait. <laughs> the board Evil cannot hide from me The weak shall perish Gain 2-2 two, two. Summon a copy. Mm. <laughs> mm. What if? Rough. Like a fungus, we spread. I'm not gonna win this one either. Actually, I'm good here. Yep. I know a soul when I smell it. You see me suck at every game consecutively weekly. That's the, the highlight of my show, is me being disappointed. <laughs> out there being a G. Oh well. So that's that's her stone Sunday morning. Her stone. What was I listening to? The really bad yacht rock the other day. It's every day. It's a palate cleanser. But actually Borderlands on Borderlands 2 on high ultra 1440p is, is a sight to behold. I will show you. You've probably already seen it. I don't care. I do not care. 
It's funny to me though, like, I was playing Crucible speaking of um, games that rip off Borderlands back last summer. And I never realized that, like, the mechanic when you die is exactly the same as the mechanic when you drop in Crucible. Like, they really loved that game, Borderlands. But, RIP. But thank God I can still play Borderlands. See this thing? And look at me, I'm out of ammo. This is, this, the, what is even the frame rate on this? It, it's intense, hold on. Change my mouse look a little bit. <sighs> look at what I got. Negotiator. Grim Assassin. Well then let's go get some ammo. <clears throat> Please insert any donated organs into the receptacle below. There we go. Ammo. A fantastic day for capitalism. Thanks for the scratch. My pleasure as always. All right. Two words, my friend. No refund. All right. Let's go. Let's go for a walk on on the wild side. <laughs> I love this cell shading. I'm actually going the wrong way. Music's pretty good too. I guess there's that boss battle I could show you that I will probably fail. I probably won't even get to it. But. I've definitely been getting better because of Cyberpunk. I say that now. But <laughs> I say that and I can't. I can't do it with much shites. Stand too close to that. <clears throat> Dow Industries. That's funny. <sighs> this is starting to look like Chicago. It's been warming up a little bit, but it's still still a bleak winter landscape. What's down here? What's down here? It's hard for me to be witty playing FPSs, especially at this frame rate, because it's a little disorienting. Plus, I still can't really hear myself and like I had fixed that monitor situation. It just makes me sound like I'm in a fucking echo chamber. 
Your dirty sausage stuff won't look like a dirty sausage. Ah, Get out of here. <laughs> Whoops. No ammo. No ammo whatsoever. That's a good good way to end your your podcast. <laughs> I did not add ammo since I started it, but yeah. We take a walk back, a leisurely walk back to, of shame, to buy more ammo. <gasps> or we just go headlong. did it too. I saved the day for myself. I did too. This is a nice shot. <sighs> well, I didn't realize there was a ladder up here. Atlas shrugged. Shrugged. I hate Ant Ran. Literally, a waste of fucking text. No offense if uh, anybody here is a fan. You're probably not because there's nobody watching this uh, in the stream. But in case you are, behind the scenes, let me tell you one thing. Aaron sucks. And so does uh, Real Time with Bill Maher. <laughs> Kellyanne Conway and all the rest of those white people. I think we should leave it at that. You know, speaking of white fragility, <laughs> I walk off into the cold, dark distance and I say, Get over it. Get over it. <laughs> See ya.